Welcome back to Up Here Cre Oh, wait. <laughs> I know, it's been a while, but I got some exciting news. Welcome back to Up Here Creative. My name is Aaliyah. I'm a UX and product designer working in Web3. And today, I got something cool. You wanna see? Yeah, so remember the hackathon that I was worried about and I was like, I've never done this before. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm procrastinating, blah, blah, blah. Don't worry me. I'm pretty dramatic. Always, it's just anxiety. But the team that I was on, we, we won a prize. We worked on a blockchain payment infrastructure to pretty much handle businesses accepting crypto. That's the project that we were on. We, we pretty much used the consensus tool stack to develop that. Well, they developed it and then, you know, I worked on the user experience and product and things on the product market and things like that. And we were able to win a prize. And because we won a prize, I got some little swag. I don't know what's in this. So I'm just gonna open it and start with you guys and uh, we're gonna see how that goes. So 
I had to try it on because I love me a good jacket. I'm all about quality. So it was pretty good quality that was made. You can see there is some um, consensus branding on the side. If I were to brand, um, design this jacket, I would probably want to have more creativity added to it. Now, would I wear these glasses out in public? No, but it's pretty cool, you know, little 8-bit glasses. Now, I'm not going to lie, I was a bit disappointed in these pockets because I thought that these were functional inner pockets, but they weren't. They were just from the stitching from the outer pocket from the jacket. So, as you can see, the glasses pop out. But I could make it work. I could probably just stitch the bottom part of it to make it functional. So overall, the Not Another Virtual Hackathon by Consensus was actually pretty nice. Usually most hackathons are like 24 hours or they're a couple of days or like even the recent one that I did in Miami during Miami Hack Week, that was during a week. With these hackathons, because you are you have such a short timeline, everything is quick, fast, and a hurry and it's a good, experience to have you think on your toes but with this hackathon being longer and having three months which is pretty much a quarter you're able to actually slow down a little bit and build the actual product because we had the three months i was we were able to have a have a hypothesis i was able to do some user interviews there were some things that i had to change or in terms of like product and like prioritizing features based on just more insights that I got from um, just reaching out into my network of more experienced designers and researchers. We were also able to utilize consensus, um, more experienced mentors to get some feedback, especially on the development side. So we were able to talk to a full stack engineer to like, just think about our product and, you know, because most of this, because it's blockchain, there's a lot of usability and development roadblocks that you're gonna have to go through. Overall, I'm really happy with the result of our project. Like I said, we won a prize, which was, I think it was like the mobile SDK, which is, a, which is pretty much us using the uh, MetaMask SDK for our, for our product and I was able to have a, a really good product, a really good project to put in my portfolio. So if you want to see the full case study on my portfolio, just go to my website at alilpierre.com and you'll see pretty much my product uh, project and then the branding side of it. So like I always said before, blockchain is not as scary as it seems. I'm Alia Pierre and you're now experiencing a peer creative. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and continue to watch my journey.